Africa is mourning the death of a musical giant. Papa Wemba, the father of Congolese rumba and an inspiration to snappy dressers known as sapeurs, collapsed on stage last month at a concert in Côte d'Ivoire. But within hours of his death, an absurd conspiracy theory started circulating back home in the Democratic Republic of Congo. In this video, one of the conspiracy theorists explains how Papa Wemba was in fact poisoned. Poisoned by, get this, his microphone. According to him, it was a stagehand, circled here in red, who brought the singer a microphone that was poisoned. Il a récupéré le micro et il a ramené un autre micro, certainement, avec un poison. And then, he says, when Papa Wemba collapsed, the same stagehand, this time shown with a red arrow, rushed to pick up the microphone instead of helping the singer. Well, that was enough for web users to start accusing the stagehand of poisoning the beloved singer. Now, the theory might seem absurd, but it quickly made the rounds online, getting 100,000 views in just a week. The story has obvious holes. You can see just by watching the video. Take a look. The stagehand isn't even holding a microphone, just the stand. In other footage of the concert, you can see the singer approaching the stand and placing his mic in it. So there was no change of microphone, poisoned or otherwise. Papa Wemba's manager told us she's planning to sue the people behind the video. But you can help too. Use your own eyes and ears and sense when you're looking at things online. If you see something suspicious, say so in the commentaries and don't send it on.